Hey you all, my name is Nurit and welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to make a gathered skirt. This is the easiest skirt ever. It's a beginner project, totally. You can make it in about 10-15 minutes. I'm going to use this lovely pink florally fabric. It's a bit sheer. So I don't know if I need a lining, but I'll see, I'll see to that later. Let's deal with problem as we go along, okay? So I'm going to cut, to start cutting the fabric. If you like this video, please like and subscribe below. It will really help with the YouTube algorithm, as everyone says. And I really need all the help I can get here. So let's get started. I'm going to attach right sides together and attach the side seams so I will have a long tube together. Stay alive if you don't wanna be her prey. Don't stand in her way. Run, run, run away. Crystallize, 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 watching her prey. Crystallize, crystallize. Since I cannot use my overlock machine since it has black thread and I'm too lazy to change it now because I, the next project is going to be black. I thought about hemming everything since this fabric is quite frayable. You could see it already frayed. I want to um, fold, fold and then fold again and seal the fraying part inside. I'm going to do it using the rolled hem foot. I'm going to show you how it's done. So I'm going to start the roll hem on the side since I don't have enough of this type of fabric and I want to practice where it can be shown. So I will do it. Roll hem is very tricky. You need experience to use it. Once you use it once or twice, it becomes easier, but um, the first time you use it, it's a bit tricky. So it's a bit tricky. Uh, so I'll show you how I do it. First I fold it and then fold it again and place a pin to secure it. Once I have the pin in place, I'm going to place it under the foot and do a couple of stitches. Then I'm going to put the presser foot up and remove the pin. Now I'm going to pull the fabric inside to guide it inside this lever here. There's a there's a, an opening where the fabric should enter. Now I have it inside, I'm going to start sewing. And it will roll by itself. Look how perfect this hem turned out to be. Look at this hem, isn't it perfect? So traditional type of gathering has never really worked for me. Whenever you uh, st stitch a straight line and then you pull it, it always rip. It, it just doesn't work. So I found a new way of gathering and let us try it now. What I do is I take a really thick thread and I zigzag stitch over it and then I'll pull it and then it will gather hopefully finger crossed. Okay, so let's do it. Now it's just a matter of gathering it, pulling it together until it fits your waist. Check out this easy breezy gathering trick. Now that the braid is sewn in the fabric, 
all I have to do is pull the braid. See, it moves. I found the largest zigzag stitch I could find in the machine. Even if the thread will tear, there's still enough uh, strength of the braid so I can pull it. This is a great, great trick. Make it even. Easiest gathering trick ever. Next step, we need to take a wide elastic and measure around the waist. So it's comfortable, well, however high you want it to be. I think something like this, leaving one centimeter to cross over. And that's it. I'm going to stitch this and then attach the skirt to the waist. So that's it, I'm going to try it on and I'll show you how it turned out. So the skirt did turn out to be uh, quite sheer and translucent, so I have to make a lining skirt. I put the lining directly to the skirt and then it will be one skirt with two layers, but I want to make the lining separate because I know there's another skirt I want to make and it's also sheer, so I want to make one lining and use it for both so let's cut the fabric eyes glow like two fires movement so graceful while cat in the jungle with dangerous claws movement she anticipates a sight is set on her prey like stars in the darkest night crystallized fascinating if you want to stay enjoyed this video please like and subscribe i would really appreciate it thanks for watching and i'll see you next week